with gang infestation and a murder rate at least 10 times higher than any other city, Inglewood has long been described as one of the toughest neighborhoods on Chicago's South Side. And my next guest is dedicated to help save the lives of some of those kids in that community. Please welcome the founder of Crusher's Club, Miss Sally Hazelgrove. <laughs> Hi, Sally. Welcome to the show. Hi, thanks for having Good. me, Steve. Tell me about Crusher's Club. Well, Crusher's Club is located in the heart of Inglewood, mm -hmm. and it is a place for young men, 7 to 18, to come after school, or when there's no school, to come box. They can make music, because we build a music studio. And um, our key is that we are rooted in four ideals, and those are discipline, love, respect, and ownership. Mm -hmm. And so um, Crusher's Club was actually uh, opened in March of 2013. And just last year, before that, we were boxing in abandoned lots and wherever we could and going mm -hmm. to some different gyms. But um, it's a youth-operated organization. We're a non-for-profit, and I'm just really proud of the way the boys are um, running the club. <laughs> now, for folks that, that are not familiar with this area out here, how, how bad is the area? Well, in 2013, you know, Inglewood led the pack for murders. I believe we had 45 or 46, and which was about 11% um, of all the murders in Chicago. So it's 35 blocks of, you know, no mid-sized business development and not a lot of opportunities and, right. and just um, a lot of street life, to be honest. What inspired you to create this program? You know, I went out to Inglewood in 2000 right after my mother had died, and um, I just knew that God wanted me out there and that there were children that needed me. And I started volunteering at a court-mandated program for juveniles. Um, after a year, I was then assigned to boys at risk to be expelled with excessive suspensions at an elementary school in Inglewood. Mm -hmm. But it was those after-school hours that bothered me. I had already witnessed, you know, shootings, gone to funerals of children, and also the epidemic of young men in the juvenile system without really a lot of intervention going on or advocating. Right. And so I just felt like, you know, if children belong to God, God is big in me, then they belong to me too. I'm like, <laughs> and I am my brother's keeper. Yeah. I'm like, and I am going to save all of them while I'm here. Right, absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. What kind of changes have you seen? You know, the biggest change I've seen is um, hope. I have 15 young men on the payroll, ages 14 to 18, and as well as a couple back from my days of advocating in juvenile court who are youth supervisors, and they're now 23. But um, the biggest change is they have embraced the mission, and they know. I've always told them, you know, I'm going to build something, and one day I'm going to give it to you. I said, but you're going to save all the children in Inglewood. I'm just going to show you how. I'm going to be the architect. Wow. But you're the one who are going to restore their paths. And together, we're going to rebuild these streets. And it wow. is us against the world. Wow. <laughs> That's pretty cool. We've got two boys in the audience whose lives were changed thanks to the Crushers Club. Say hello to Deontay and JoJo. <laughs> OK, good. Uh, Deontay, Jojo, how, how has the Crushers Club uh, affected your life? It, had, it helped me how to stay out of trouble and to stay on the street with the guys. It helped me how to stay in school to get my education so I can make it. And then now I can show people the talent that I got from Crusher Club. And now I'm a Goldie Glove boxer. Yep. Well, sure is. Like wow. Jojo, what about you, man? I ain't gonna lie, I used to be one of them kids. You used to hang out on the streets. just want to stay outside. Game bang, hang out with the guys. But ever since Sally came around, she changed my life around, put me up in music studio. That's something I want to do all my life. And she gave it to me. She gave me an opportunity to help others and show them the same thing I know how to do. Wow. You know, <laughs> one person can affect a thousand kids' lives. But here's the domino. Those kids, mm -hmm. like you're saying, will turn around and affect other lives. Yes. Everybody just wants to see a way out. Yes. They just want to see some hope. Man, what y'all doing over there? We doing music, we boxing. Man, they ain't doing nothing else, man. Don't nobody want to die. Don't Thank nobody you. really want to go you. to prison. But but if you no, if you're made to think that that's all it is, then there you there you go. There you go. And these young men right here, they're going to teach it. Mm -hmm. They're going to teach it and show it and, and to guys that you will never be able to reach. That's right. 
And that's why you, you're a hero to me, mm -hmm. but you're a hero in the community. And that's why we've called you today's Harvey's hero. Yeah. And we got you this. Ooh. That's yours. You're a real Harvey's hero. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. I think Thank you're you. great. Oh, my God. That's not all, though. We reached out to our friends at Green Dot, and they want Sally to keep helping the youth over there in Inglewood. That's why they're giving her $5,000 on a reloadable prepaid card. All she has to do is successfully register. That's yours, darling. Thank you. God bless you. You don't know how bad we need this, because we have about two weeks of payroll left right now. But I've always said, I'm like, I don't care. God's gonna do it. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. Bless you. My wife is on the show today. She's not out here, but she's, she loves kids. And so from our foundation, we're gonna add another 10,000 so you don't oh my God. get the payroll. <laughs> Keep the kids out there for fighting. Hey, look, uh, for more information yeah. on Green Dot, just go to steveharveytv.com. If you want to help out, folks, it's a great program. Help get these kids together, okay? Thank you, Sally. Thank Keep you. up the good work, Thank darling. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah. God bless Absolutely. you. Thank you. Thank you. That's good work.